Hello guys, welcome to my channel. And today we are going to learn Automation Anywhere A360 introduction. So uh, as we discussed in the earlier session, we are going to learn each and every concept on Automation Anywhere A360. This is the first video on Automation Anywhere A360 series. So in this video, we are going to learn uh, Automation Anywhere A360 introduction. What are all the features available in Automation A360? commands, actions, we are going to learn each and everything. So let's get started. So first of all, we need to, uh, you know, register in Automation Anywhere A360 Community Edition to practice the Automation Anywhere A360 commands and process, uh, so processes. So to do that, we need to uh, provide the details such as first name, last name, business email ID, and phone number, company name, country, job level, all these th details we need to provide in community edition link. So I'll share this link in the description or else what you can do, you can just type the keyword like a, A360 community edition in Google, then you will get this link. So once you navigate, to, once you provide all the details and if you click on get free community edition, you will receive an email from Automation Anywhere team. So you will get a, uh, Automation Anywhere A360 control room URL and um, user um, registered mail ID and password. So once you log into the Automation Anywhere A360 control room, then I'll show you the look and feel of A360 control room homepage. So this is the control room, uh, A360 control room homepage. So here you can see different options and features are available like create a bot, uh, open IQ bot, open bot insight, IRE, discovery bot. So these are all the advanced features and functionalities on A360. We are going to learn each and every concept in the upcoming session. So, um, <clears throat> so far we need to install bot agent for this. So if you face any issues while uh, registering into the community edition or logging into the community edition or while downloading the bot agent, please let me know or you can drop a message in the comment session. I'll try to help you or to register and log into the Automation Anywhere trial version or free community edition. So let's get started. So in this video, we'll focus on uh, creating a new bot. So later we are going to learn IQ bots, bot insights, open IRI, uh, IRI concept and discovery bot as well. So let me click on create a bot. Once you click on create a bot, so you will get create task bot pop-up window. So here you need to provide details such as name, description, and folder. So folder is nothing but where you want to store the particular process or task. You can choose the folder structure. So here, let's say I'll provide first bot and the name of the task should not exceed 50 characters and description is optional. If you want to provide the description, you can provide or else you can leave it blank. So the maximum character length of the description is 255 characters. And later you can choose the folder structure. So let me click on browse. And here you can choose the folder structure. By default, you will get a bots folder structure. Under bots, if you want to create any folder, Yes, you can create a folder. So I'll show you how to create a folder under bots as well. For time being, I'll choose bots folder structure. Let me click on choose. And once you click on create and edit, then uh, the, it will navigate to the develop development editor. Let's see. This is development editor. So here in the left hand side, we can see variables. So variables, we can create new variables by clicking this plus icon. So here you can see the different data types are available. Uh, any string, number, date time, Boolean, file, window, list. These are all the different data types available in a variable. And also if you want to utilize, you can utilize the predefined system variables such as uh, date, time, hour, millisecond, uh, OS name, month, minute, everything. So, okay. So we are going to learn each and everything. So as per our agenda, we will cover one by one topics. We will cover anywhere 360 and comments. And then we are going to learn message boxes, variables, data types, files, folders, loops in, in a sequential. So uh, 
Oh, in the variable session, we are going to cover each and everything. What are all the custom variables? What are all the predefined variables? What is clipboard? What is what is the string variable type? What are all the system variables? What is automation anywhere? Installation path, task path, a task name, control room, CPU usage, date. So we are going to discuss each and every concept and how we can utilize these predefined system variables in real time scenarios. So each and everything we are going to learn. So let me go to another tab now. Uh, that is actions. So in the actions tab, you can see different uh, packages. So we can call it as packages. Let's suppose if you want to work on XML application, here we have XML package. Okay, so there are several uh, commands available under XML package. Let's suppose if you want to work on uh, text file. Okay, so get text or let's suppose if you want to work on PDF application. So here you can see different features or comments available under PDF package. Similar way, if you want to work on IQ bot or if you want to implement few conditions. So here you can see if else, else if. Uh, similar way, if you want to work on files and folders, file, uh, so create a file, delete a file, get file name, open file. So these are all the sub comments available under file package. Okay, so email automation we can do, we can work on date and time and also we can work on CSV or text files. Also, we can work on different applications, packages, and we can automate each and everything by using these commands. So we can, we can search command or package by using this search box option. Let's suppose I want to work on Excel package. So I can just click on Excel. So then you will get all Excel related actions or comments. So Excel basic is there, Excel advanced is there, Office 365 Excel is there. We are going to learn each and every concept. What is the difference between Excel basic and Excel advanced? So we are going to learn. Uh, so let me go to triggers concept now. So if once you complete the development, let's suppose if you want to schedule a bot, let's suppose if you want to trigger a bot, so we can, trigger and schedule by using control room. Also, if you want to generate specific event trigger, yes, we can generate a specific event trigger by using triggers concepts. Here you can see two different options are available. One, one option is triggers and second one is start to end. So whenever if you click on this, any one of the trigger event, then it will navigate to, uh, it will store under this trigger box only. Let's suppose, uh, if you go to action command and if you double click on any one of the action command, it will, uh, you know, store and in between start and end end only. So we uh, we will learn each and every command and how we can utilize these triggers. What is the start and end? Let's suppose if you drag and drop few action items. So here you can see the. Uh, flow development ed editor. Let's suppose if you want to change the uh, view, then you can just click on list. So that view of the development is different. But uh, if you want to uh, no, change the development environment in dual mode, you can see both the uh, in, uh, flow as well as list editor mode. So once you drag and drop any one of the command in the right hand side, you can see this corresponding properties of the particular command. We need to set the uh, properties and we need to choose the specific action to perform. And then just we can click on save. And in order to run this bot, we have to click on run bot. So this is the just basic overview of automation anywhere A360. Uh, so we are going to learn each and every concept in the upcoming session. Hope you like this video. Please subscribe and don't forget to click on bell icon. That's why you'll be notified every time when I upload a new video on series on Automation Anywhere A360. Thank you.